What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming and we are here with the boss room final round level 28 prison of elders we have been grinding all morning long it's into the daytime almost into evening we are doing work showing you guys a couple of new drops that we also got at the end of this I want to take this time to show you guys how to play effectively in the prison of elders now as you guys know and some of you may not know that the last round which is round five in prison of elders there is a boss now this boss here looks like atheon's child who is very pissed that we shit on his daddy and he's here to kill us so as a team we have set up two hunters and one titan now some of you may be like well why would you be a hunter hunters aren't that great well i have the blade dancer set up for the hunter which utilizes the invisibility perk and it could really get you out of some awesome awesome le horrible sticky situations now the titan is arguably the most effective and clutch character you need for prison of elders that helm of saint bubble that blinds people and gives you blessing of light uh, and or armor of light depending on your play style or your team's play style could really save you and i mean really save you now this is only level 28 so it's no big deal this is kind of just an introductory for everyone that may not be so familiar with um i don't know horde mode i guess you could say if that's what you want to call this and we are over here taking out Atheon's child and the 365 Galahorn. I made a video showing everyone how to easily ascend your weapons. All you need is, is an exotic shard and uh, a little bit of glimmer and you'll be good to go. So we have gotten done with the round. Um, this is the way all like the format of all of Prison of Elders is exactly the same. You kill the boss, you run back to the airlock room or whatever the guy calls it. His voice is very creepy by the way. It really gives me a headache. I'm actually like talking to you guys right now and I have the worst headache because I've been listening to this guy, his raspy ass voice talk to me all morning long and I hate it. I don't even know what his name is because it's just so annoying. But anyways, you're here. You're super excited that you just completed Prison of Elders on your respective level, whatever it may be. And a big ass hole comes or opens up pretty much in the ground. And you want to jump in. Uh, you can dance if you want first. And you want to jump in. Now, I, I, there's speculation. I want to talk to you guys about something. There's a lot of these like platforms before you get all the way down to the bottom Honestly, I think I could be wrong, but I think that if you maybe do a flawless run of Prison of Elders, you can possibly get uh, another loot room there. Uh, when you get to this loot room that looks like freaking Aladdin's or the Genie's Cave, I'm just wondering where the hell my lamp is so I can rub it and get three wishes in real life. But you you get two small chests and one big chest. You guys, the big chest, it requires a treasure key to open. And I know that treasure keys are just not dropping for you guys. Remember, I do have uh, a very effective way to farm for treasure keys on my channel as well. So for those of you who are watching this and have not taken the time to subscribe, please hit that subscribe button, beatbox that subscribe button. The PS4 giveaway is still at 10,000 subs. And the more you guys help this channel grow, the share my videos around, tell your friends to come over and sub, and be active viewers, then the more faster I'll grow and give that PS4 away because it is just collecting dust. Now, here, as you guys can see, I got a fusion rifle, uh, which I'm not too you know amazed about. The perks on it are not that bad. Uh, and a couple of my friends, when they open the chest, uh, or actually obey he got a scout rifle and which he'll put on and I'll show you guys at the end of the video uh, what his scout rifle was and what the perks were now as you guys see I'm 32 and a half currently I, I'm this video was done a little bit before but I am a level 33 now and in the next video I'll be showing 32 prison of elders and the most effective way to beat it and um, the rewards we got and I will tell you guys the you know 
how to get to level 33 super super easy in the next video and then the next step will be level 34 thank you guys so much for listening remember if you guys enjoyed this video even a little bit you know take two seconds to hit that like button it really helps me a ton and i will see you guys in the next video good luck guardians peace